Also trending today out of the U.S., Nikki Haley, the former South Carolina governor and United Nations ambassador, announced her candidacy for president. You should know this about me. I don't put up with bullies. And when you kick back, it hurts them more if you're wearing heels. I'm Nikki Haley, and I'm running for president. Nikki Haley is the latest to throw her hat in the ring in an effort to become president of the United States. Republicans have lost the popular vote in seven out of the last eight presidential elections. That has to change. She becomes the first major challenger to former President Donald Trump for the 2024 Republican nomination. The announcement marks an about face for the ex-Trump cabinet official who said two years ago that she wouldn't challenge her former boss for the White House in 2024. But Haley says she changed her mind in recent months, citing the country's economic troubles and the need for a generational change, a nod to the 76-year-old Trump's age. The Washington establishment has failed us over and over and over again. It's time for a new generation of leadership. Haley served as South Carolina's governor from 2011 to 2017 before joining the Trump administration as UN ambassador. She gained attention during her time as governor for moves like signing a bill that removed the Confederate flag from the state capitol following a mass shooting at a historically black church. Haley left the Trump administration in 2018, reportedly on good terms with Trump, but became more critical of him after the 2020 election and the January 6th riots. Other Republicans expected to launch campaigns to be selected by their party include Florida Governor Ron DeSantis and former Vice President Mike Pence.